Good morning and welcome to Break Mitsubishi. My name's Joel, and today we're going to be having a look at this 2017 Ford Ranger Wild Track PX MK2. So, this vehicle is in your six speed automatic, which is very nifty to have. It's uh, approximately three, four years old now at this stage, just done 131,000 kilometers. It is in the magnetic color with use your six speed uh, automatic 4x4, 3.2 liter turbo diesel engine as well. So, it is in pretty good nick as well. Just having a quick look as well. Now, this vehicle, we're gonna be having a look at the exterior condition, the interior condition, and also all the features. However, because it is a little bit misty and dewy this morning, I may be able to miss something on the exterior of the paintwork. So please keep that in mind that if I do miss something, I do apologize in advance. However, if you do find this vehicle is something that you're looking at, please come down and view it today because I don't think it's gonna last long, especially being in the category that it currently is. It's definitely gonna be a steal. Just having a quick look at the front here, we can see we do have our headlights and also our fog lights just under there. Our front sensors are also in this vehicle as well, so they're located on the very front, which are color matched, so they're pretty hard to spot unless you're actually looking for them. Our Ford Ranger badge and also our grille right in the center there is in a very good nick. Makes it look like a very aggressive car. Continuing through, we do have our color matched wing mirrors and door trims, so Something to keep in mind, it just adds to that sleek look of the car itself. Um, 3.2 liter six auto badge on the left hand side over here with our wild track there as well. Now these wheels, uh, which size are they? Let's have a quick squeeze. And they are your 18 inch rims. Uh, they are an all terrain tire, which are in very good condition. I think that they are almost brand new. So as you can see by just having a quick squeeze, we do have our little indicators still on here. So I don't think that's had very much use, if any, on these tires at all at this current stage. Um, side skirt over here as well, uh, which is pretty nifty on a car, especially if you're trying to get in and out of them uh, quite regularly, it does make it quite difficult. Quick look at the door. Again, it's in pretty good nick too. Now, I've, unfortunately, I need to go around and unlock the other side. So what we'll do is we'll go around the exterior and then we'll go back through the interior in just a moment. So we do have our roof rails in this car, which are pretty nifty, especially if you're gonna be putting anything on the roof, they come with it. You've got your color match sports bar, which you can see um, that's the mist this morning. We've already cleaned the cars and also shamed them. So it just shows you how cold it is. I think it was about five degrees before. So just something that's kind of keeping us uh, a little bit chilly this morning. Uh, as you can see on this, rear wheel as well it does look like it is a, another tire which is in pretty good nick another all-terrain tire um, which is in good order there as well coming around we do have our bull bar and also our tow bar with our uh, plug on there now we do have the roll top on this vehicle as well which is very nifty to have however they're pretty hard to open with one hand um, so i'm not going to try to open that one on camera for you today however i'll see if i can have a quick look underneath which i can so we can have a look. We do have a tub liner built into this car as well, which is pretty nifty. Um, if it is a Ranger one, it was probably done from the factory. So that could be something that could be very good, which is in good order. We do have our mats here and here, which is good uh, to know. So that means you can tell that the previous owner has actually cared about their car if they've gone to the investment of putting car mats in it as well. Minor little scuff here and also just here as well. So there's a few scuffs there, keep those in mind. Rear right hand tire over here is in good nick as well. Another all terrain tire, which is in pretty good condition. Continuing through paintwork yet again, pretty good nick. Can't notice much, if anything at all. Sorry, it's in pretty good condition over here. Let me just jump in so I can actually open the rest of the car for you. And I'll turn off this radio in just one moment. Alrighty, so we'll continue through. Now we'll have a look at the, the interior of the car as well. So we do have our orange tan look leather, which uh, does just add to the flow. Uh, it's the fabric and also leather combination on the car. So as you can see, just having a quick peer around, it is in very good condition. Minor marks, however, it's just something that you do get after time on a car. Driver side footwell is in pretty good nick there as well. Rear passenger side, uh, sorry, rear driver side over here is in good condition. Minor scuff marks, which you can see that I can point out for you on the video, which is very handy to have um, them pointed out so you know exactly what you're going and looking at purchasing. Door trim, again, has your leather flow through look uh, with your orange stitching there as well. 
which is in pretty good condition there too. So we do have good amount of storage on the back of the drivers and also the passenger side. Now we have a 150 watt, 230 volt, sorry, adapter, which is your um, universal adapter on the very back here, along with a 12 volt adapter as well. We do have cup holders in the center, which are nifty for you if you do need to have those in the very back. Now I'll go around this front hand side here. Now this rim and tire is in good nick as well, so pretty good order. Um, so something to keep in mind. Continuing through, we'll have a look at the drivers, uh, sorry, the passenger side over here as well now, which is in pretty good condition. So minus scuff marks, just keep that in mind, but just does come with the age of the car. So you do get those over time with having the vehicle. And our door trim over here as well is in pretty good nick too. So minor little scuff marks, of course, uh, which you can see there's some just there and also down the very bottom here. Driver side, uh, sorry, rear passenger side now. I'm doing this back to front in comparison to what I'd normally do. Is in pretty good condition as well. Door trim in immaculate condition over this. Oh, actually, sorry, my apologies. There's a small little scuff mark. Good, good amount of storage space though, and it keeps it very, very well. Now this vehicle is one of those cars that this color does look immaculate and amazing when you do pair this with our hydro protection package. So if you would like any more details about that, please ask our staff. However, with our package, we do cover your exterior of your car, um, the interior as well. So we give your leather a little bit more of a little bit of a coating so we can actually moisturize that up to reduce it from any uh, further damages uh, in the future. And if you do spill anything in your vehicle as well, we do prevent any of those from actually staining. So whether that be a coffee, uh, any Hungry Jack sauce, it's my, my biggest killer, and also some soft drink or even any of the kids' drinks, uh, iced coffee as an example as well, all covered via lifetime warranty under this current vehicle because it does fall into that category for you. You also do get your darkest tint available for you as well. Just having a quick look at our entertainment and also our system here, which you can see there's lots of your features and settings all built into it with our fuel control, also our temperature and all that into the center. Now you can see it's a pretty chilly morning. Just having a quick look at here. It's five degrees currently up the very center there, which is pretty nifty to have in a car. So you can know exactly what it is that you're getting yourself into. We do have our uh, indicators on the right hand side there, along with our lane, uh, keep or lane warning so lane departure warning by the looks of it uh, which is very nifty to have wiper controls on the left hand side over here as well now our lights are located on the right hand side down here so it's slightly different however they are on you, you can put them on auto as well so something to keep in mind we do have a spotlight uh, or lights on the very back there uh, which is pretty handy also our dimming features for our interior um, functions and all that Cruise control settings on the right hand side over here, along with our settings to go through all of our, uh, basically center compartment over here. So you got your speedometer, distance to empty, your RPM, you can change your way so you don't have to, so you just want your fuel meter, or if you want to get your, your actual temperature, entertainment, navigation, your phone system. So you can have your navigation system all coming up on here as well. Head unit as well is in pretty good nick, so um, no issues or anything there. Uh, you can change through everything, connect your phone, have all of your phone calls coming through there, not a problem at all. In our climate control settings, it does look like we do have either a built into the car itself with just your dual climate control settings, or we have our settings down here as well, which are very nifty to have for us too. So as you can see, we have uh, dual climate control in this car. So one's a 19, one's 23. So if anyone likes a little bit cooler that's um, in the car with you as well, you have that option to kind of change down one side over the other two 12 volt adapters and also two usb slots with your parking sensors your traction control your rear diff lock hill descent lots of features packed in there also you've got your red arc brake controller there as well so all of that's very nifty to have your two high four high and um four low all located here as well so your four wheel drive con uh, control settings we do have that stitching as you can see flowing through which is very nice and just it adds to the wild track theme theme and again through the dash stitching as well so this vehicle, as mentioned before, is currently sitting on about 131,000 Ks. 
Good amount of storage in the center compartment here. There is a little coin holder as well. So uh, it's pretty hard to see with the color, but you do also have a little compartment so you can hold any coins if you need to. Just having a quick peer around. Now this vehicle is just on the edge of its uh, warranty on the car itself as well. So it's definitely something that could benefit from one of our premium mechanical protection plans. So if you're going down the path of uh, looking to cover your vehicle for another potentially five years or up to 200,000 kilometer warranty, you have that option available to you. So um, please feel free to ask our staff. And the only catch with that is you have to look after your car and you just have to service it as per normal. So nothing really out of the ordinary as you would normally do that. However, you are covered up to 200,000 kilometers on your car as well, or up to five years. However, we do have another warranty currently available, which is uh, quite unique. Please ask our staff and we'll be happy to assist you further about that. So other than that, if you'd like any finance quotes in this vehicle, please feel free to ask our staff. It'll take you approximately five to 10 minutes and it's a non-obligation finance quote. So you're able to get some figures to see if they stack up for you. If you're purchasing this for a business purpose, please note that everything that I have mentioned for you today is all tax de um, deductible. So we also have in our premium mechanical plan protection, you have up to 10 years of roadside assistance built into that as well. Uh, and you do have other roadside options available for you too. So you can also get them and snag them with the car too, as well. They are additional extras. Unfortunately, we can't do them um, as a throw in for you. However, ask our staff, we'll be happy to help you and assist you where we can. So thank you so much for coming and having a look at our Ford Ranger walk around. This was a 2017 Wild Track, done approximately 131,000 Ks. It's a very good bang for your buck right now, I can tell you that. So this vehicle won't last long. It's currently located down here at 20 to 32 Canyon Drive in Berwick. You're able to come down and view this car yourself, or if you'd like to make an appointment and or purchase the car over the phone, please call our staff, pick up that phone, 9907 555 We'll be able to assist you further with your inquiry with purchasing the car or anything further questions that you may have. Thank you for watching. My name's Joel and have a lovely morning.